It's huge the need we have for people getting involved in the program. They're unsure of maybe the dynamics of the program, so they just they don't take that initial step to walk in the door and, and ask those questions and maybe go to an orientation to see what it would be like. It's a fun thing to do, but you're going to make an impact and, and be a role model even if you don't think you're being a role model. You know, you can completely change a person and guide them in the right path and, and really influence their lives for the better. I remember when I was younger, I had a lot of problems with my mom. We didn't really like communicate well, we didn't get along, and I feel like having a bigger, older sibling I can talk to, that she actually understood what I was talking about, and I think it just helped you develop as a person because you understand other people's perspectives more. So it's not like she was against me, but she wasn't taking my side, you know? Our conversations have got a lot more serious and our topics aren't so much about, you know, junior high things, it's more about her career, her life choices, and things like that. I want a job so I can have that comfortable life like her. I can have that baby with the house when I'm older and have a wedding like she did. The program will end, yes, but our friendship won't be. We're, we're in it for the, for the long run now. <laughs> I've always believed that children need a lot of people around them to give them a really fulfilling life experience and help them grow into dynamic, diverse people. I didn't really get any time to have friends over, so the big sister really helped. One of the offshoots of our relationship with Big Brothers Big Sisters is that they've supported Emily in her pursuit to make a difference in our community. Emily started recycling and the gist of it is eventually she set a goal to be able to go to Disneyland by collecting bottles and cans and she did it and then she kept doing it and we set up a not-for-profit organization and she's now sent three families to Disneyland. It took a little while but finally they found the perfect match, match for me and him. Chase is a friend of mine now, right? Because because of the connection we made through Big Brothers and Sisters, I don't think that there will ever be a time where we're not in touch. He's like the one that I could talk to, wouldn't get mad, wouldn't try and give me advice. He would just listen. If he hadn't have done this, I don't know. I don't know where I would be if he hadn't signed up again for Big Brothers Big Sisters. We just came out with a new study and uh, one dollar of your investment, so whether it's donating or uh, being a big, so volunteering, um, goes back $18 into the community. Get involved. All it takes is a couple minutes to an hour to impact somebody's life like he has to me. He really come here because it's 100% awesome. <laughs> the children we say we're impacting are eventually going to become full, independent, adult persons who will give back to the community themselves. The relationship has been really meaningful for me. Um, being able to influence somebody's life like this is pretty awesome.